It's West Michigan's first local TV talk entertainment showgram. Don't miss Grand Alley with Gregory Strew Saturday nights at 1230 on Channel 3. And now, here's the only host who thinks Burger Chef's going to make a comeback, Gregory years that I've been spending doing the show, I've been punched, kicked, laughed at, and told that I was no good. And that was only in my bedroom. So it was just kind of... <laughs> it's nice to see I was able to come out here and make my mark. John, you want to get a custodian in here to clean it up? And fire up a cappuccino because this week's show, Graham, is cram-packed with more entertainment than Bob Dole's Depends. So I gotta tell you. WWMT is a CBS television affiliated station which airs such programs as Touched by an Angel. Yes! Which is the only thing on TV dealing with touching not involving a Kennedy. Ooh, I just want to let you know. <laughs> and I want to apologize for our starting the show so late, but I was busy taping a guest shot on a show for the network. Yeah, it was an episode of Shaken by the Nanny. The results of our November sweeps have been in. Did you know that? Probably land. Turns out our numbers were so low, the new Warner Brothers network is talking about picking us up. <laughs> Scientists in Raleigh, North Carolina, say that it would be optimistic to think that daily birth control pills for men are just around the corner. Yeah, apparently it makes all the women in the bar sober. So it's just <laughs> take that shot. the night spirit shining bright how long have you been great well since i've been in grand rapids michigan now very few people know that you you came from the twin cities right i had an aunt shirley who had gingivitis lived there and uh <laughs> My it was just something <laughs> oh, has it become pc to say is it african-american or is it okay to say black perspective well, I don't know Gene Gordon, Liddy. I just... Uh... <laughs> I thought maybe we'd take a lesson from Lorena Bobbitt and cut this thing out of here. Okay. Yeah, we're having a conversation while I take my finger off with a butter knife. Okay. Why do you think there's become such uh, an importance in angelic presence? Angels have been around for hundreds of years, and now people are finally in a whole new level of conscious and awareness. Now, here's the deal. How you doing over there? Is that okay? <laughs> I love all of you. My. You say what the prize is going to be? I, I was telling the staff, maybe Britta would like to take my putter home for the night. <laughs> I could cook a turkey in my pants here tonight. <laughs> God, it's hot up here. Well, at least you know you have something going on down there. Right. <laughs> okay, one for him. A show on a bus? That's right. Find out Saturday following Star Trek only on Channel 3. And now, here's the only host who can play fair, but not pay his fare, Gregory Strauss. We are on a bus, a Grata bus, and Eva is sitting way in the corner over here because you're like, I'm not getting in on this thing. You are all by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> What does that feel like, kind of being a mentor now to some of these kids? Well, I, I think it's very important. We're on Grata, and we'll be back right after this. We've decided to walk in on Tony Gates' morning show and ask him a few questions. You don't have an appointment, then. Hey, which means what? Which means you have to leave. Yes. You don't have to be rude. You don't have to push. 97 LAV. Can you box and you got a real mean right hook? Well, if you if you do, you might get in some big trouble because it can make some blood on somebody. <laughs> Nona. Yes. What do you Nona? What do I Nona? I know a lot. <laughs> I know your hand is somewhere it shouldn't be right now, young lady. Now, what do you I think like of it? <laughs> well, they're cold. They're not hot cross, that's for sure. But I'm blessing everyone today. Oh, good, okay, now you're good. blessed. Oh. Hi, would you like to buy some soap? <laughs> Ask you some questions regarding, like, the election today. No, I don't speak English. Who was the second president of the United States? 
Jefferson? Where are the answers for this, Kara? Because I don't know this one either. <laughs> I don't know if you folks have ever had a chance to go through a haunted house. But even though I have a group of people right here, I am like scared shitless. The group that's going through right now is kind of slow, so we don't want to ruin their fun. So. Did they come in on one of those half buses or what? <laughs> I have no idea. Ah! Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> All right, you guys can start skating. We've used you already, okay? <laughs> this is Greg Struess for everyone here at Kentwood Fun Spots. Thanks for being with us. We'll see you next week. Goodbye. Yes, I can. Suddenly, yes, I can. Gee, I'm afraid to go on has turned into, yes, I can. Take a look, what do you see? 133 pounds of confidence, me. Got the feeling I can do anything, yes, I can. Something that sings in my blood is telling me, yes, I can. I was just born today, I can go all the way, yes.